Hey, if it isn't the life of Chuck. in the leaves. They get to uh, <laughs> video me, video you, videoing me. Videoing That's what usually me. happens when you get two YouTubers. Yeah. <laughs> two YouTubers on a houseboat. Oh, I'll ring your doorbell. Ding dong. <laughs> ding ding ding. <laughs> Nobody's home. That's okay, the window is open. Oh. Lock the doors, but the windows are open. I want to air it out. Oh, your door over there is open too. Yeah, yeah I know. <laughs> Welcome to my mess. Oh, perfect. Oh, you have a, what do you call it, a little gener uh, generator? Mess, or a, yeah. yeah, I got a portable. A power thing. Portable power unit thing. Oh, perfect. And this is my, oh, there you can I have a little. Uh, inverter thing? A little inverter and a bigger, bigger inverter, a 450. So I just oh wow, you got everything you need. But usually, I have the bed pulled out. I, I don't usually See, leave it in. I want to have that. My bed is that size right there. It is? Oh, okay. That's yeah, too this small. one I just slide out and I have a, a thing in the back I just put down. But right now, see that's where my battery is. My host battery is here. Okay. So, so that's, that's good. And, and it's covered. I usually, this sits on top so it puts pressure on. So. So that's what I got hooked up. Oh, perfect. And that's the big welding cables that run to the alternator. Oh, yeah, look, yeah, yeah. And see, it has a little fan Oh, a there. vent. A vent and fan, if I need. That's all you need right there. But I don't want this here. Um, I want to eliminate that so I can have a walkthrough okay, What's stopping it from going underneath the bed? Uh, no, I, I got a water tank under there. Oh, that's where that is. And the heater, the factory heater's there. But what I'm thinking of doing is taking this and putting it here because this is empty. That's nothing but storage. Okay. And I don't use it. I just junk it oh, there. Oh, there's your fridge. So what I'm going to do is put that battery there. There's another battery outside here. Oh, there. In that. And that's the where I'm going to put the solar battery. So that will be for solar only. Oh, wow. And the other one I'm going to keep as an alternator. So I'll have two. So the wires three. from this don't even go to that side. No, I don't know. I think the wires from that go to the propane system somewhere. I haven't traced it down yet. Oh wow. So I haven't had, I got so many things on the book. <laughs> um, and and this, this is hooked up to that battery. Okay. But it's got nothing right now. And um, my There thing, you go, you got a thing right there. Yes, I can do an extra, but that's hooked up to that. Yeah. Um, the sink has an electric pump, so um, it runs off of that one too. And all these old school lights, it runs off that battery, oh, okay. but it's dead, so I can't use it. And if I ever hooked up a fan. And you have a shower too? Uh, no, it's just a bathroom, which is actually just a closed closet. What the heck? So, fridge, Dometic fridge. This is not bad at all. Mm, not bad, not bad. A uh, Dometic for 2200 bucks. That's you get the I overhead think. just like I do? Correct, which is storage, which I said I got to clean out and just so Mine had a, another part that pulled out and it came out. It was a bed up there. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's this uh, one doesn't have a slide out. Some of them you can slide out as a bed, right? Um, no, this is this is pretty good. This is very nice. Uh, not, not bad, not bad. I don't mind it. Perfect. And all my, look, I just got junk. <laughs> out. You know, you know how that works. Just junk that I gotta get rid of. Yeah, yeah. And this one's more of my cleaning, drink, uh, coffee cups and toilet papers and. Ha! I'm I'm disorganized. Pots and pans I put all in the back. Food is there. You know, I think I've met a couple of girls that have the vans that are the most organized. All men are in this. Oh, uh, no uh, organization. You don't need it. Um, I never use a propane stove because I haven't had the propane system checked out yet. Okay. So I just run off of this Coleman. Um, this is hers. This is Korean girls. But one, the connector is not working, so she needs a seal on that. <laughs> that one will go back to her. She can have a back. I like how your kitchen is set up. That's I like uh, that. I, I kind of like this. I just want... Are you going to leave that hose on the back, on your propane tank they're permanently connected uh, at this point probably because you know what I in my unit in, in my van 
I leave it connected and I actually leave the tank on all the time, believe I'm it or not. I'm going to leave it connected. I'm pretty secure too at this point. Like I say, I kind of like that it's vented here. I, I could close the door and keep whatever. Right. If there is any leaks, usually at night, that's how I set it up. If by any chance, I don't. Well. But I'm pretty. That's great. So this is kind of, but now that I know that it works, I can do a more permanent structure, but for now. Yeah. That's kind of. No, that's good. Yeah, and if you get it moved over here more permanently, where you can just Correct. push it in out of the way. Well, like I could tie it up to there or that door, but I don't want to do that. I think it's easier to move around, like your buddy or yeah. Martin. Sorry. But a, like a, a, a what do you call it? A temporary uh, sitting spot. That'd be great. So when you sleep at night, do you figure out which way, level, like leaning this way or leaning this way, and you put your head always at the top, top end, or do you always sleep one way? I. I'm usually, I usually sleep that way, but depends where, if I'm parked, I'll switch around, yeah, depending yeah. if, if Mine too, is that, that yeah. end for me is always higher, okay. and you don't want to sleep with your head down, because yeah, you get a hell of a headache yeah, in the morning. Yeah. So I always try to sleep with the head on the upper end, but mostly it's that end, I'm sleeping this way. Correct. Same, same way. Uh, yeah, so. I, I, for me it depends on... But yeah, I still got more, believe it or not, after two and a half years of living out of vehicles, I still haven't purged everything. I still got things I want to, <laughs> like that crop, and there's some more crop that I would like to get rid of that I don't need. Yeah, it's, it's, like, it's amazing after you're in there for a while, you find, realize how much you can get rid of well, and still have everything I, you need compared to what i used to have in a house and apartment i i just can't believe the crap that i had i know and i don't miss any of it honestly i don't miss well, this is a memory foam it's a four inch but i wish and i have a two inch or inch and a half under okay but i would like another two inch yeah i've got to do something with mine i make it a little different yeah, this folds out to right. right yeah, to the I think you should go thing. back and find out where your glasses are. Yeah. Hopefully home. they'll pick it's them home. up. It's home. Yeah. How long have you had this van? Uh, a year. A year, eh? A year now. Because I saw some of your older videos with that other. The gold. The brown one. color, the gold yeah, colored. I had the gold one. Uh, that one was a cheap buy. I paid twelve hundred for it. Oh wow. You got the same perfect. kind of curtains as I do. Goes around the front. Yeah, I do that. I got a blackout too. This thing I use is a blackout. Oh yeah. Um, this is a dollar store special where I can. Cool. I, I can hang all my jackets in that. Sweaters, long sleeve. Exactly the same dash as I have. Yeah, yeah. They never change them. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Never yeah. Everything in the same place. Uh, amazing. Just oh, I'm running out of battery. Uh oh. Well, great. It's Thank you, Chuck, for your interview and your review. It's great. Loved it.